Today in Taiwan, people from all walks of life are choosing to be stung by bees, often dozens of times in one sitting. <laughs> Shou Rong Chen is battling multiple sclerosis, a disease which slowly causes the body's nerves to deteriorate. For six months, I was bedridden. I could not move. I would have symptoms of tingling and numbness in my hands. It was excruciating pain. Then, Shou Rong heard about bee sting therapy. For help, she turned to Mr. Cheng Yi Chen, bee sting therapy master, a trained master who has practiced bee sting therapy for 12 years. Every week, Mr. Chen and his assistants treat 200 patients and sacrifice 6,000 honeybees. The results, he says, can be astounding. After 600 bees, you will look five years younger than your contemporaries. But can bee stings really help Shou Rong fight multiple sclerosis? She began an intensive course of therapy, receiving over 200 stings a week for months on end. Honeybees only sting once, and they die soon after. But even separated from the bee, the stinger continues to inject venom into its victim. The body responds with a flood of histamines and white blood cells. And soon the area becomes hot, red, swollen, and itchy. He gives me one sting. I don't even have time to feel the pain before he stings me again. And the pain lasts for one hour. Many think it is based on the 5,000-year-old practice of acupuncture, a proven treatment for pain. Although today Mr. Chen sees bee acupuncture as a labor of love, even he once considered it taboo. In fact, like most of us, he was afraid of bees. 30 years ago, Mr. Chen was an executive for a textiles company. Then his wife began to suffer from arthritic pain so severe she couldn't cook or even stand up straight. Western medicines didn't do much good. But when she told her husband she wanted to get stung by bees, he thought the idea was ridiculous. Naturally, as an educated man, I was against it. We just did not understand bees. But Mr. Chen completely changed his mind when he saw his wife's sudden improvement. After three months, her red blood cell count increased. Her headache disappeared. I was so surprised, I decided to dive into this mysterious treatment and to collect all the information that I could. Mr. Chen vowed to devote his life to bringing bee sting therapy to others. After six months of bee sting therapy, Shou Rong Chen has seen a dramatic change. She insists the therapy has relieved her multiple sclerosis and given her a new lease on life. While most Western-trained doctors would likely say her illness is in remission, Shou Rong is convinced the stings have helped her walk again. It will take years of study before we'll know whether bee stings can relieve arthritis or multiple sclerosis or even the common cold. But whether Shou Rong's recovery is in her head or her hands and feet, for the first time in more than a year, she feels she can resume living. A therapy most of us would find taboo is allowing her to face the future with renewed hope.